Hey everybody, Brian Hoagley. Welcome back to Cecil Life. Follow us down and around on Twitter, LinkedIn, using hashtag Cecil Life. Obviously, thanks out to Side Channel. For today, I want to talk about micro segmentation, zero trust. Definitely an area that Side Channel is focusing on with its Enclave product. But let's dig into what is micro segmentation? Why is it a pathway to zero trust? No, not saying that micro segmentation or our product is zero trust. That is the entire concept. What I want to focus on is one aspect of that, the technical underpinnings to zero trust. So how, how does micro segmentation work? How does segmentation work? Well, if you're as old as me or older, you're familiar with wanting to, you know, compartmentalize networks. You remember on-prem networks before the cloud? Yeah, they existed on earth. Anyway, we used to want to build out structured environments that weren't flat. Go figure. And now, because of the proliferation of cloud, the expansion of systems and such, now we have large scale networks and unfortunately segmenting them has go, gone by the wayside. So looking at two networks connected by cloud and VPN activity, let's kind of go through what would happen with zero trust versus non-zero trust thinking on applying micro segmentation to a network. So here we have one network couple of servers, some database access on the back end, same thing right over here. Without micro segmentation, access into these systems would allow you to go from one to another, to another, to another, right? Basically a very flat network. The concept of zero trust is compartmentalizing these systems so that they are only accessible when you're allowed into them, when you're granted that access. In fact, you can even segment access between systems. So this becomes very important when you start thinking about compartmentalizing environments so that in case one area gets breached, another area is not also compromised. Versus, again, if I'm able to access into one system through, you know, maybe the front door, maybe I'm able to VPN in into an environment, really, whatever it is, I can now have free access because these are an open network and more of a flat network, I can now access these other systems. Versus here, if I were to only compromise one system, I would be, well, stuck kind of in this compartment, right? That's the entire concept. That's the thinking. And generally, this is not done because it is difficult to, one, assess how many systems you have in your environment, what those systems do, but also Rolling these out has traditionally been done via hardware means. Well, with software-defined networking, or SDN, we now have the ability to start implementing segmentation using host-based firewalls, other controls, to keep these systems from not communicating with those systems they really shouldn't, or allowing people to not communicate with the systems that they shouldn't. So basically, general concept, but not put into place, not put into action, yet incredibly effective when looking to defend a network and in fact be able to contain a network or quarantine uh, a breach. These, these are very big aspects. Everyone focuses on obviously, hey, how do we stop everybody from coming in? Well, if we're creating VPNs and creating ancillary ways for people to access the networks, we have to think about where else can they go once in. It's no longer just Let's put the good front door in and everyone who's allowed to come in is supposed to the way they are, act accordingly, and there's no chance that they'll ever be compromised. Well, let's assume breach. Let's assume zero trust. Let's make it so that we do not trust those that are coming into the environments and accessing them. Therefore, how do we build those networks? How do we build those environments when we're thinking about a zero trust? And micro segmentation or just segmentation is one key concept to be able to make that happen. Again, just some thoughts and some ideas, pretty basic concept, easy enough to roll out, very proud of what we've done with Enclave and pushing this concept out to market through software defined networking. Again, Brian Hoagley with Side Channel, follow us anywhere around using hashtag CISOLife. You can follow me down on LinkedIn. I'll talk to you later. Thanks.